Maya and in today's video I'm going to be going back to my roots, back to where I came from on YouTube and I'm going to be testing out a new product that I've been looking for for quite a while. If you know me then you'll know that at some point in my life I want to get some tattoos on my body. Well it's obviously going to be on my body, I don't know where else I'd get one. <laughs> so when I saw an advert for this product pop up on my Facebook feed I got very interested. This video isn't sponsored or anything by the way, like I'm genuinely interested in trying this product but the brand is called Inkbox and they do semi-permanent tattoos. They're like the kind of temporary tattoos you used to get all the time as a kid and it was like on a little bit of paper you put it down you put a wet paper towel over and they lasted like a day or two you could get like glittery ones they were the best. <laughs> These are kind of like that but you can put in the design that you want and they can last for up to 18 days so it's kind of like a try before you buy tattoo service so I think it's a really good idea if you're not sure on getting a tattoo but you like a design you can put the design into the website it prints it off on one of these and you can have it just for temporary on your arm or anything to see if you like it before you get it. Hence why it says temporary bad decisions. <laughs> this product is American and it's made in America but obviously if you can't tell by my accent I'm in England and I live in England so it does ship to us. I didn't have to pay customs or anything as well which I mean score. I think in total for my tattoo and shipping and everything it came to about $32 but the tattoos do vary in prices depending on the size you got because I got the biggest one you possibly could. <laughs> Difficult. This is the design that I went for it was already kind of like pre put on the website so I just clicked it and I was like you know what I'll go for you. So it's a nice kind of string of flowers and I'm going to put it on my right forearm because that's like where I want to tattoo. It makes sense. So in the words of the packaging I think it's time to get inked. Let's get inked guys. Okay it comes with instructions that's handy because I'm dim. The tattoo just a packet labelled cloth a ethyl alcohol wipe and a glove. <laughs> Two gloves. <laughs> right, let's give this a whirl. Let's look at the instructions. Okay. Um, you know what? I'm going to do the safe thing and I'm going to watch the video tutorial because then I know I can't get anything wrong. Okay, I've just watched the video that they have. I recommend watching the video rather than just reading these and going off them because it explains it a lot better. So firstly, I'm putting the glove on the hand that I'm using to apply the tattoo, which is my left hand. And then you peel the white, this side, off the tattoo. <gasps> we've done it, we've done it, we've done it, we've done it, we've done it. Oh my God, this is tricky. Okay, now I need to stick it to my skin firmly. You can only do this once as well. So I'll try and do it so you can see. <laughs> that looks wonky. But you know, you can only do it once. So you press it down firmly. So that's what I'm doing. It feels really weird. <laughs> then you peel this black one to reveal the ink. I'll try not to damage anything because it's me. Anything could go wrong. Mm. Okay, then the next step is to heat up the cloth in the microwave and then put it on. But before you put this on, you take the alcohol wipe and dab it only on the blue bit. So for convenience reasons, I'm gonna do this first and then run and do the cloth really quickly. What does dab mean? Am I wiping or do <laughs> I don't know. I'm being very as careful as I can here. Okay, now I've done that, I'm going to quickly run and do the cloth. So I ran and sorted out the cloth. I folded it into a square like it told me to. And now I'm just applying pressure for 30 seconds and then you just need to hold it firmly for 15 minutes. <sighs> Just run up the stairs if you can't tell, I was in a bit of a hurry. I'll come back in 15 minutes when this is all ready to be taken off and I'll keep updating you as it develops. Okay, so it's been 15 minutes holding firmly on the tattoo. So now it's time to take the cloth off. Oh, it's all wrinkly. And I just need to peel the tattoo off in the direction of my hair, low and slow. Ow, ow, ow. Ooh, it's like ripping a plaster off. Oh, no one tells you about this bit. Oh. Oh. oh, that hurts, that hurts. This is what my arm currently looks like. It is red because I'm in an awful lot of pain. But I'm really happy with the positioning of the tattoo. It's really faint for now. Like it's just kind of light green, but the tattoo develops into its full black like potential. 
within 24 to 36 hours. So that is the exciting bit of applying it done. So I guess I'm going to come back when this is fully developed, which again could take between 24 and 36 hours. And I'll give you a little update and I'll see you then. So the tattoo has been on for about three and a half days now. And it did look a lot darker than this when it first fully developed, like within the first day. So it has faded quite a lot in quite a significant amount of time so it just kind of really now is looking at how long this lasts for it looks nice and it looks like a real tattoo and loads of people have been asking about it but i'm just a little bit worried about how long the fading is going to be happening for not gonna lie i've just been dramatically dancing around my living room to harry styles but it's time for the next update so it's currently wednesday meaning that it's been three days since my last update and it also means that the tattoo has been on for about six days bear in mind which is a shorter amount of time than it said the minimum it could last the big reveal here is what it looks like and to be fair you can hardly even see it very much. You have to be really close to it to be able to see that there's actually something there and it's not like a dirt mark or something. There it is a little bit closer. It's really, really faint and I'm actually really surprised at how quick it's faded. I did everything the instructions said, I swear. So now this is just kind of a waiting game on when it's going to fade completely to the point where you can't see it at all anymore. So yeah, this is it now and I'll give you a little update soon. So this is the last little update I'm going to do and if you're wondering, yes, I have magically just suddenly gone blonder. I put the on last Wednesday night and it's currently Saturday meaning it's been on for wow I am not good at maths okay I've worked it out so this has been on for 10 days and the packaging did say that it could last for a maximum of up to 18 days but it kind of varied depending on each person and this is what it looks like now you can't see it it's completely gone you can only see it really if you look like this and you squint really hard. I really, really, really like the idea and concept of this product. Like it's a really good way of getting to know if you'll like a tattoo or not before you actually dedicate yourself to getting it. So it has been useful in that having a tattoo on my forearm, I actually really enjoyed having it and I like the look of it. So it's kind of made me a bit, it's encouraged me a bit more to actually get a tattoo there, which is obviously useful. But I have to say I was a little bit disappointed because it only stayed like opaque black, like a real tattoo is for about two two and a half days so it has a very very short time frame of it actually looking realistic but you know in that time it's pretty damn cool <laughs> if you want to go and check it out the link to this product will be in the description once again i'm not sponsored this isn't an affiliate link i just wanted to try it out if there's any other products that you want me to try and test out and show you what i think of them please comment them below and i'll get myself on to doing that other than that thank you very very much for watching i've got loads of other videos so feel free to go and watch some more. I hope you all have a lovely day and I'll see you later. Bye! OMG, it's Maya. She has sorted out a certain attire with makeup moments, lifestyle too. You'll never get bored. OMG, it's Maya.